Across parts of Europe, some of the oldest structures share an odd trait. They do not sit on surface soil. Instead, builders cut directly into living rock even when softer ground was available nearby. In Germany, Austria, and parts of France, narrow stone-cut tunnels, known as Erdstel passages, were carved straight into bedrock. Not reinforced soil, not packed earth, solid stone. Above ground, prehistoric stone chambers and foundations often show the same choice. Extra labor, more precision, and far more time. From a modern engineering perspective, this is inefficient unless stability matters more than speed. Bedrock resists settling, limits moisture movement, and holds its shape over centuries. What's unusual is not that ancient Europeans understood this, it's that they applied it so consistently across regions with no clear shared blueprint. Most of these sites leave no records explaining why. Only the physical decision remains. They avoided surface soil, they chose permanence, and archaeology still doesn't fully agree on what problem they were trying to solve.